Bubbly Devi was among millions in Indian villages who had to walk long distances from their homes to fill water from community taps and other sources for washing and cooking. I had to go very far in the morning, afternoon and evening, often making two or three trips each time. It was the same struggle in every home in Kunsal village in Himachal Pradesh state. We needed five to six buckets a day for bathing and cleaning. Fetching water was as good as doing a job. That decades-long trek ended for Devi and Lal a few months ago when a tap was installed in every home in their village under an ambitious $50 billion nationwide program to provide piped water to all rural households. Only one in six of India's 200 million households and villages had access to water in their homes until five years ago. That number has increased to about three in every four households as engineers have raced in recent years to lay a network of pipes. The task is not easy. Himachal Pradesh state, where Devi's village is located, for example, gets ample monsoon rains, but the water flows downstream in the hilly region, creating shortages in summer. Winters present other problems. Merely providing tap was not sufficient. We had to have a uh, uh, regular and uh, portable water to each and every household. So challenge was a big because uh, we have very remote areas. We have uh, uh, areas with temperature up to minus 20 degrees centigrade, minus 35 degrees centigrade in some uh, regions and uh, tribal areas. So uh, this was a tough job. This network of storage tanks with a treatment plant will supply about 10 villages. Providing clean water is critical in a country where waterborne diseases are rampant. We provide 70 litres water per person per day in every household. We can give more, not less. Having a tap in the house has transformed lives for these villagers. <laughs> now there is no problem. It feels good. Devi's daily task of tending to household chores is lighter. Earlier, fetching water used to really increase my work. Now I get some rest. However, experts warn that as piped water becomes more widely available, authorities will have to ensure its judicious use in one of the world's most water-stressed countries, where shortages are worsening. This student knows the value of saving water it gives him two more hours to study. We don't waste water, and if I see someone's tap is open, I shut it. Building a culture of water conservation will be key in ensuring that these taps don't run dry. Anjana Pasricha, VOA News, New Delhi.